Hello and welcome. You're watching Bangalore Akbar with my colleague Aftab. This is Ashfaq Siddiqui. To serve mankind, there are many ways. There's healthcare, there's education, you feed the hungry and almost. But there is an innovative way of serving. This is about providing the nutrition to the infants who are the future of India. So the group of youngsters from Bangalore have found an innovative way of serving these kids by providing them milk every day. These guys, they started this service in the last lockdown and they have served almost 20,000 liters and this lockdown also they are serving the same amount and it's increasing day by day. When tragedy hit the world, hunger was one of the most devastating challenges that handicapped... So let's talk to the man himself. Welcome to Bangalore Akbar. First Thank and foremost, heartiest congratulations for starting this kind of innovative service. How did this idea come into your mind about uh, providing the nutrition to the infants? Yeah, uh, thank you so much for having me here. Uh, to be honest, last year when we were uh, distributing ration kits along with our family, uh, there were some uh, mothers who came up to us and who said that, you know, sometimes the government gives us ration kits, you guys give us ration kits, but no one is looking after our small kids. It's because we don't even have half a litre of money to buy even half a litre of uh, milk for, for our children. Uh, so that is when we realized, okay, like, uh, you know, the needs of all these elders are being fulfilled, but who is going to look at these kids? So we started Mission Milk with that, with the mission that we will provide milk to every child and, you know, help them to how much ever we can. But in the whole process, we want to inspire a lot of people to do the same because we can do it to an extent, but we wanted to create this awareness more than anything else. There was one more incident that I remember a mother, uh, when we were distributing uh, ration kits again, a mother was feeding her child in a bottle of milk. She was feeding the child hot water. Basically, what she wanted to do is she wanted to fool the child so the child thinks it's milk and it sleeps. Oh so this felt really bad that we realized that this is how much a child needs milk because all of us as youngsters, we've been drinking milk. We've been forced to drink milk because of how important it is and these children are craving for it. So we thought as youngsters, this is something that we can afford. This is something that we can even buy for our own pocket money. It is not very expensive, but with small amount of money, we can make a huge difference to these kids. Which are the areas in Bangalore that you are covering up now? Yeah, so far uh, in Bangalore, uh, we are uh, targeting towards north of Bangalore, uh, like Hegede Nagar, Bellarli, DJ Halli, uh, Tani Sandra, and uh, even the south side, we are going Avalalli, Manchinali. We are trying to find these areas which are in the rural side and where a lot of, where milk is not being able to, you know, reach to these areas. So we are trying to reach to as many areas that we can that is possible so around as of now around 13 liter 13 areas every day and we are distributing around 600 liters on a daily basis now since you are doing it from last one year and we also saw on the social media that many celebrities cricketers and all endorsed your idea yes. they have mentioned your name as well so now uh, from where do you generate the resources for this whose money is it that you distribute this milk from where the money comes from so what we did is Initially, we started from our own pocket money, then we reached out to our family, we reached out to our friends, got a little more, uh, uh, you know, donations, but then we realized that we need to go to the public. So that is where we first made a fundraiser page on Milap. So that is a platform where you can raise funds and it is very transparent and very accountable. So we used this platform to raise funds and uh, through our social media campaigns, we made people go to this uh, fundraiser and... Uh, you know, donate as much as they can and make the difference. Do you supply the ordinary milk or do you supply any particular brand of milk? Okay. So, we particularly in Bangalore, we've chosen Nandini as our mm -hmm. brand because it is, a, it is a brand from KMF. It is a government brand. So, we thought this would be the safest and this would be the best brand since it is available in every area since we have a decentralized uh, way of produ uh, distributing milk. So every area has a Nandini parlor in, uh, around it. So we chose Nandini as our brand because we get it at a good price as well. Now, since you are uh, distributing this Nandini brand, KM that belongs to the government of Karnataka, yes. and you are giving free of cost to the people, yes. did you ever try to contact the Animal Husbandry or KMF Milk Federation so that you get it on from the CSR quota free of cost so that you can supply it to the larger numbers? Yes. So. Honestly, we did uh, get in touch. We tried our best uh, through social media, through their websites to get in touch with KMF and, like you said, animal husbandry uh, organizations. But uh, unfortunately, we've not been able to 
even have a conversation with them because it's hard to reach them as of now. So we are trying our best. We'll still continue to reach them because our priority is that they create a solution for this whole problem. And since they have all the milk that is really required, they can definitely come up with a very good solution. We can work on it. We can work around it. Now, uh, our viewers, who our viewers are watching, if somebody wants to donate on their own or somebody wants to donate their milk to you, how they have to do this? How they can contact you? Or how do you inspire them to do on their own? Right. So if you want to help us, you can find us on our social media pages, which is on Facebook and Instagram. We are called Mission Milk, M-I-S-S-I-O-N, M-I-L-K. So you can find us there. You have a link in the bio. Honestly, before even donating, I want you guys to actually go through all our work, you know, to see what exactly we are doing before even giving that one rupee. But uh, if you want to do it by yourself, that is even better. We'd be really happy because this is our whole point that especially youngsters out there, we really want you to take that charge. Even if it is giving milk to a maid in your house, to her children or a construction site outside your house, there's someone there. Just take the responsibility of one child and make sure that you give milk to this child. That is all is required. So even if you want to do it by yourself, our social media handles have information of how to be a milk angel. So anyone who is helping a child with milk is called a milk angel. Even if you raise awareness, even if you give us donation, if you're not able to do it by yourself, we'll help you take that milk out there. So you can get in touch with us. We will be delighted to help you from any city, any area. We will show you exactly how to do it the best possible way. Thank you. You are part of this Mission yeah. Milk uh, from the beginning itself. So how do you experience this whole... It's a wonderful initiative started by Mr. Zufi Shan. I'll tell you one story because everyone feels at the time we can't do great help. So we were sitting in his house and talking before this second lockdown happened. So he told me now people are not earning even I don't have the right to help people. I don't know how to take forward this machine. So out of nowhere he got a call from Dance India. And he went there, he rotated what he was showing, then automatically we got funds. So basically people have to believe in themselves that they can help out, they can reach to people. Once you start taking that first step, the journey begins and everything falls apart. So I want everyone to donate to Machine Milk and help us take this forward. Thank you so much. As you heard these great boys of India, the future of India lies on our infants and it all depends on what kind of nutrition food we provide our youngsters to make them stronger so that our India becomes stronger. Uh, from On behalf of the Bangalore Akbar, we urge all our viewers, we'll mention their contact numbers and the email addresses as well. Please come forward and help these boys to serve more and more needy because there are thousands and thousands of kids in India, millions of kids in India who needs better nutrition. Keep watching Bangalore Akbar with my colleague Aftab. This is Ashfaq Siddiqui. Stay safe, stay blessed. Thank you.